it's happening in New York, New Jersey, or Long Island. Hear about it with Joe Piscopo. Mornings, 6 to 10 on AM 970. The Answer. Man, is my man Scott on the radio? Scott Lebedo, patriotic artist, activist, and all-around great citizen of this great uh, country. Scott, how are you this morning, my friend? All right, Joe. Listen, how many times do I have to tell you crazy morning people that us artists, this isn't our time. This isn't our time. You guys are sleeping, and we're making magic when you people, when you normal people are sleeping. No, that was my, that was the former Joe, man, because I got to tell you, Scott, I'm so with you on that. I now get up when I used to come in. You know what I mean? It's like, and I'm looking at the clock last night, and, we're, and like I was saying to Debbie, we're trying to sleep. You're right. So t- you know who used to work and paint late at night? Frank Sinatra. Did you know that, Scott? He was like, he was, he would, he would be, it would be late at night. He couldn't sleep, the old man, and he was a, actually a good artist in his own right. But, Scott, you are just ripping well, it up. Tony Bennett is a great artist. Tony I didn't know, Bennett I mean, is, too. You're right. You're right. Yeah, Tony Bennett. And, but where did you? I ran what? into him, yeah. Does he know, did he know your work, Scott? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. He played at the St. George Theater a couple of times here yeah. on the island. Yeah, and, uh, yeah, yeah. I went backstage to meet him, and uh, he knew my work, and I was really honored. And, you know, I said, you know, obviously I know your work. Uh, so, yeah, that was pretty cool. You, you know, it's, it's, you never know what kind of people have that gift, you know, have yeah. that gift. You know, if, every day you find something else. If you're, about you're, lis- you're listening and you're watching on YouTube and Facebook, I have to tell you, Scott Labato's a friend. He, he is such a, a great guy, but he is so talented. Have you ever seen this man? And you have to check uh, check him out online. We'll give you all the information because you believe in this country, Scott. You believe in uh, what's going on. You believe there is hope, and you stand fast in your, in your support of the United States of America and you do it through art form and do you you run into political problems with that though don't you yeah well I uh, hey listen I'm an Italian guy from Staten Island I wear everything <laughs> on my sleeve you know <laughs> I'm a big huge Trump supporter I uh, as a matter of fact I'm uh, scheduled I just found out I'm going to be performing at Mar-a-Lago ah. Thanksgiving weekend for a big uh, veterans fund tr- fundraiser but I will be able I will be performing in front of the great the greatest president of our time and his family, and I, uh, you know, again, get to, he owns a couple of my pieces, but I want to really get a little closer to uh, this great patriot because, again, we're both unconventional people. I shouldn't be an artist, you know, because I happen to lean right and I happen to say what I want, and I love my country and I love my family, you know. So that just like Donald Trump is not, he's not a politician. That's yeah. what makes him so great. Well, but, that's why we love him, and that's why people <laughs> hate him. Listen, i got to say this. Wait, this whole McCain thing. Yeah. Everyone knows how I feel about my veterans. The guy was a hero, yeah. I, I, a true hero. But I love that all my Democratic friends, my liberal friends coming up to me like, isn't John McCain, doesn't, wasn't he the greatest? I'm like, wait a minute. Wasn't it you when he was running for president against Barack Obama was calling him an old, white, racist <laughs> <laughs> now, because he 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 didn't like Trump, he's your hero. It's so amazing. <laughs> Listen, this is the be- an artist. I wouldn't want to live in any other times in, in, in <laughs> civilization. We are living in the in most insane, beautiful, sexy, weird, surreal. <laughs> I, I I can't. You can't paint the stuff. You can't. I can't paint what I just explained about. I know it's beautiful you though. Can't put that on yeah, yeah. Tell me about nine thirty with uh, Scott Labato at Joe Piscopo. Scott, tell me about the new art uh, uh, artwork uh, with with uh, Donald Trump. Did you? Is it like a statue now you put together? Is that what I'm hearing? Well, I, I did this. Uh, I don't know if you could show it on on the, on the screen. I did this big fifteen foot carved twenty twenty out of foam and painted it red, white, and blue, and then wow. I put Trump's muscular you know, image on top of that. And I put it on somebody's front lawn in just the regular residential house. And, uh, you know, all hell broke loose. Everybody, that's a story. Oh, we're looking, we're looking at it now. This is, this is Donald Trump arms folded, jacked, uh, uh, a a Jack Donald Trump in a t-shirt. And I see 2020. It's a, this is great. This is, but it's life size. Oh my gosh. It's 15 feet. You put this on a lawn in public. Yeah, the guy let me, you know, I'm always looking to do crazy stuff. Because the art world, do you think that the art world would let me do something like that? Even though it is art, it's yeah. not that kind of art. So i got to find my own galleries, which is fellow Trumpers, you know, fellow. <clears throat> yeah. That's my uh, fellows. But, but the beauty is, you know, why people say, why 2020? It's so early. It's too early. It's only 2018. And I'm like, every time 
whether it's The View or whether it's some jackass ripping up Trump star, what, what, all these hatred. Every time they do that, they don't realize that they are building the base for this great president tenfold. He gets more votes every time, whether it's Robert De Niro crying like a oh, – please, don't even get me started. Yet they every time he opens, <laughs> this, this, this happens – we are locked in for 2020, so I've been pushing this whole 2020 thing early because that really burns the snowflake. I know, really. And I know, Scott, I know you would you would go into a, a closed cage match with Robert De Niro, wouldn't you? I mean, you just have a look. I don't know. Listen, I don't know about that. The guy, you know, he's, you know, maybe he, he's. A, I'm only 53. He's in his 70s. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Listen, I use my gift, my top, my 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 weapon is my paintbrush. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. Hey, my you know, political you, correctness for twenty five years. Scott, you, know, also, you throw it at me, I'm throwing it back because yeah. I'm, I'm the only one. That's the whole point, Joe. Yeah. Name another artist in the city that's on my side of the fence. Yeah. That defends, you know, people like Donald Trump. I'm it. I'm yeah. pretty much it. So and, I, and and I say the airwaves are open if someone is uh, opposed to that, doing the same thing that you're doing with such passion, Scott Labato. But it's it's great to see that you're courageous enough to actually believe in this and to exhibit your work in such a patriotic fashion. Artwork for the Mid Island Little League team rally. You is, that is spectacular. That that we're looking at it now uh, on our screen, and we invite you to go to am nine seventy the answer dot com to check this out. That is beautiful, beautiful work, Scott. Joe, let me tell you, let me tell you something. See, now, you know, there's, there's my political side, but 90% of it is just pure patriotism. And these kids, we watch this game. See, I mean, if you, if, you know, if you watch the games, what there was no politics involved. That's exactly right. what That's I, right. I'm about to say. There was no ugliness. There's no million-dollar contracts. It's just these kids in this small-town USA. Staten Island, it's part of the biggest city in the world, but it is small-town USA. So I knew they were coming home, the welcome home. So I contacted uh, some folks on the Little League, and I said, I got to do this beautiful gift. That's their logo. I painted it as the flag, and we hung it up when they got home. But uh. the beauty was when they pulled up in the bus, escorted by Rescue 5 fire engines and the police, and I'm telling you, it was like Frank Sinatra was showing up at his first concert. <laughs> the crowd was wild. I was crying. Oh, it was man. The pure, it was pure patriotism, you know, that you can't. Yeah. yeah, only Rock, Norman Rockwell actually would be able to paint that. Well, I tell you, I said that earlier. You're like you're like uh, Norman Rockwell on steroids. I said, but also very. I love, now, was Jackson Pollock an, uh, an influence for you, Scott Labato? I, I am so many different influences. Believe yeah. it or not, I'm a big fan of the old masters, Caravaggio and Michelangelo. Wow. And, uh, you know, so uh, some of my flag paintings, if you see, you know, are straight and clean and curvy. And some of them, like you said, I just love going wild. Yeah. It'll be three yeah. in the morning. I yeah. get a half a bottle yeah. of doers in me. And I just got the cameras out and I'm got my clothes off and I'm just going oh. crazy, throwing paint around like a madman. And to come up with, you know, so, and anyway, so it's... Oh, man. I, I'm got, living life, man. This is why I'm so patriotic. Oh, I'm look at that. We're, we're, putting a, we're putting on the screen now John Wayne. That's a great picture of John Wayne. And again, am970theanswer.com. Uh, John Wayne on a horse with American flag in the background. We love it. Scott, where can we find your brilliant work, my friend? Just uh, my website, man. I mean, just Google images on, you know, just on Google. Uh, but uh, my website is... Uh, ScottLobato.com. All yes, right. Sir. It's L O B A I D O. ScottLobato.com. Scott, you are the best. I'll see, hopefully, I'll see you at the Tunnel to Towers, and I'm, I may, I'll probably see you sooner. But uh, God bless you, man. Godspeed. We love your spirit. We love your patriotism. And if you're listening, am970theanswer.com, you will see the images, and then you can go to ScottLobato.com. Scott, we'll see you soon. God bless you, my friend. Love you, brother. Love you too, Scott. Great guy, Scott Labato right there, and a brilliant artist. And whether you agree with the president, don't agree with the president, this man is as patriotic, you know what, as we all should be. Everybody knows this guy. No, everybody knows he can do a radio show. Joe Piscopo. Mornings, 6 to 10 on AM 970. The Answer.